Hello lovely viewers, this is the Snorky Raccoon here with Coffee Holic. We're back. I don't want to do this. Of course you do. You are a masochist, aren't you? Only sometimes. When it suits me. And when you're playing Dark Souls. And when I'm playing Dark Souls. Woo, long loading screen. Now oh, there we are. Fuck, this is so creepy. the plan was wine cellar. And there we have it. Convenient. Oh. Uh inventory. <laughs> <laughs> that is one of the most annoying mechanics. Yes, you have to click on the item before you can use it. Uh what button? How do I Oh, I have to double click it. Lovely. Your know, primer's been a little jittery. Oh, it shouldn't matter. You won't be able to see it, lovely viewers. It's still staying above three. Just so you know, uh, first monster I see, I'm actually going to panic and shut down the game. That is just a heads up. He felt the wind gently sweep across his face and his dry crust. This looks familiar. Well... <laughs> you are in the wine cellar, of course it would be familiar. Oh. You know all about wine cellars. That I do. Well, should I say that Daniel does? I don't even know what a wine cellar is. Never been in one? Nope. Uh. See, a wine cellar is where you hide the bodies of your fallen enemies. Just also, something about wine, I think. I thought I heard some what was that sound? Monsters well, can't get me. We don't. Monsters can't we get don't me. know what it is. We don't know what it is, but we do know that it is hungry. And you look like a snack. So is the in. monster roaming around now? Just tell me, play out. Is it roaming around now, or is it is it triggered? Uh, I think it's triggered when you pick up the first item, but I can't be sure. I, I don't think it's roaming around just yet. Uh, it... Where did the baron go? Who cares? Keep that blessed up wine the last of the life. Or at least until tomorrow! <laughs> I thought I heard something just. Yeah, well, by the way, I can hear the dialogue right there, so there may be some audio bleed through with your uh, audio levels. Again. One second, lovely viewers. I'm gonna fix that. Okay, Probably. that should be a little better. Okay. Yeah, so. I thought I heard something. Uh, so. I think as. Yeah, I think as soon as you pick up. One thing, the monsters will be around, but again, I can't remember fully since it's been two years since I played this. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. Well, I am not exactly a reliable narrator. Not a reliable narrator. You hear that, viewers? We're fucked. Oh, my lamp went out. Have fun. You still have three uh, chunks of oil. So, yeah, yeah. Okay, um, this one must be used for decapitating. Actually, that that's for sandwich making, but okay. Okay, it, it, what's, why is one missing? Someone gonna sneak up on me. Well, it's an armed monster. At least it's not the pliers. I'm happier that it's the hammer than the pliers. Pliers are much more painful. How do you know? Um, also, if you turn on the, uh, well, here's the hammer. if you turn on the, if you turn on the candle there, you won't waste oil. Oh yeah. I always forget about oil. So when I pick this up, I'm fucked. That's what you're basically saying. Uh, I think so. It depends if it's ornament, the uh, the thing to stop the sea or the reach or the fourth thing. Then yeah. I really don't want to do this. this. <laughs> Go for it. Remember, you do in fact only live once. Although, um, since it's a game, you can reload whenever you make up. Fuck up. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember when you encountered the first monster. Don't worry, don't worry. Is it right outside the door? Ah, no. It's not. That would be cruel. They always make sure that you can hide. Don't trust you. 
Well, you have good reason not to, but you know, it's not gonna eat you yet. Yet. I hear something. Yet. I hear something. Yeah. Barrow protect me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They, um, can't kill me if they can't see me. Can't kill me if they can't see me. They made sure that there's a lot of background noise that will um, creep out the player. And uh, it seems to be working, and I'm enjoying it. <laughs> I can tell that. Mm -hmm. It's it's schadenfreude. I'm taking pleasure in oh. your pain. And I think the viewers are as well. Well, of the viewers... Also, what's your sanity at? Uh, head is pounding and hands is shaking. So that is sobriety being forced upon you. You are less and less drunk. So now your hands are shaking. You are waiting for your next fix. Uh, stay closed. Uh, you placed a barrel in front of it. I don't think you can close it properly yet. It is closed <laughs> properly. Uh. Fuck. Why okay, another light scared? sword that isn't your candle. Um, so not a candle, so you don't have to waste your... Oil? Oil. Okay. Yeah. Center boxes are more plentiful than oil anyway, from what I remember, so... I think it's supposed to be more pleasant. Oh, yeah. Now, can I stand here to regain sanity? Yes, I can. Yeah. Also, whenever you solve a puzzle, you regain some sanity. Oh, God. There's the second one. <laughs> well, since I don't have anywhere to hide, you said that they will give me places to hide. Does this have an autosave feature or something? Or... Yeah, I think so. Okay. It saves progress automatically. Fuck. See that bang on the head? That's where the monsters are appearing. You may have a very minor case of um, major blunt force trauma to the head. I see. Am I supposed to move? Ooh, by that the way, out go the way? to the corner. Go to the corner. There's oil there. Oh, you're right. Yeah. Lantern fully refilled. So whenever you see those, that means you get free oil. Strongest man in the world, right here. Yeah. Strongest man in the world. I feel like I'd rather be using these as weapons, to be honest. Well... He can barely lift them, so using them as weapons wouldn't be ideal. And even some of the bigger weapons in history, like the Zweihander, were actually very, very light. You know it wasn't light? So... Long poles used by the Irish. However, you are an Englishman, and as such, you don't have the strength of an Irishman. You need to move the last thing. Right They're very anal about it, so... It's my just-in-case barricade. <laughs> that way, if I see something, I can push this in front of the door and see. Taken care of. No, 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 you need to stay up there. Fuck. <laughs> Wait, maybe... Um, I think it'll still work. Two out of your, you have two yep. out of your four required items. So go out and get the last two. One of them is Aqua Regia, so once you get that, you're good. Once I get Aqua Regia, the monsters will appear, won't they? I honestly can't remember which of the four has the monsters. Once I see the area, I will know, because it's very easy to be recognizable. Oh, you you just you got out, so you got some sanity back. That's the blue flashes. Oh. But it's it's you can think of them as uh, Daniel's uh, sigh of relief because, whew, I did it. Kind of like that. So he restores some sanity whenever you see that. 
Oh god. Also, if you're afraid of the monsters, your lantern is kind of like big and shiny, so that's just saying. Is this the room? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Fucking hell. What's happening? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you're jumpy now. My chest is going I am. Um, apparently the sleep deprivation made me a bit braver. This is just not my genre. This is why I've owned this game for over, what, two years now? And I've never played it. Oh, by the way, remember those uh, people who were locked in the wine cellar? Yeah. That's what that started, but what it was about, and you didn't really pay attention. Oh, well. Well, I think I got it. Is this... What's this here? You can first? pick up a tinder box. You should probably pick up the tinder box before you do anything. Oh, fuck, this is what you were talking about. I know it now. No, no, this mm. was not what I was talking about. Sure. Yeah. Feels like it. Aqua region, you now have acid. Yeah, I know. I think I ate some bad pork the other night. Oh, 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 yeah. Acid. <laughs> These, um... <clears throat> oh, fuck. I don't actually want to read this. Does it really matter? Should I read it? Uh, yeah, you should read it. It's just gonna make it better. So, my name is Wilhelm, House of Gerich. These are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I summoned to the castle. I was summoned to the castle Brennenberg. As most of the aristocracy, I was curious about what this supposed knight of order could warn from me and accepted the invitation. The Baron was friendly and offered me a proposition. Oh, you want me to continue? <laughs> I'm still speaking what I want to, to be honest. Uh, <clears throat> it dawned yeah, on me the that the nature of the contract was sordid, and that the reason I was chosen was because of the follies of my past and not the honors I've been rewarded with during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim and do so without asking questions. In return, he would attest to my character at the royal court, advancing my position within noble society. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly, and I accepted wholeheartedly. Let's see, is this scroll down normally? Oh, I closed. Did not mean to do that. Can I still read it? Uh, if you open your journal, you can find it again. Journal J. Notes. Ah. Wilhelm's last words. Ever since that day, I've brought men, women, and children to Brennenberg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred, none of whom were ever seen or heard from again. Tonight, the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cell to celebrate our work. I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us to a toast. The wine tasted fine, and my, my, my men drank without restraint. So begins the punishments for my sins. The Baron has locked us, and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I have done. I was weak, and fell into his diabolic ways. My men are screaming. The skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides revolt against their god-given nature. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes and I can no longer dot dot dot. That's fun. It is too, isn't it? So that's what the monster is on. Guy. He's... Ah. I'm assuming. Hmm. Oh, it makes uh, sense. Remember that uh, the monsters is something the shadow is bringing after you. Oh. Well then. And Alexander isn't the shadow. Alexander, he's a dickhead and he is, in fact, killing hundreds of innocent humans, but it's for a different reason that will make sense to you later. I'm still 
so very cautious right now because I have no idea. I do. Then I don't have a vague idea since it's been ages since I played it, but you know, it's still a vague idea. And you remember, you need to find the fourth thing. Language, because uh, there's no reason to swear, you fuckwood. <laughs> ah, yes, there is no reason to swear. I'll tell you what reason there is to swear. I'm fucking scared. You're very really least scared. You're... you're not scared, you're just. What was that? <laughs> well, the entire scream distorted. So that was you. That was a loud scream, right? No, that was the sound of a monster. I'm assuming. Yeah, it, it's behind it was that a door. Scream of some. It was a scream of some. Oh! If the enemy is near, stay out of sight and hide in darkness. Make sure to turn off your lantern if possible. Guess what you're about to encounter? The game is very subtle. Oh, by the way, if you crouch, you're less visible. Thank you. By the way, if I were you, I wouldn't turn around and I would turn off that lantern. Oh god. What's gonna happen once I pick this up? Well, right now you're losing sanity, and if you lose too much, he's gonna say things and make loud noises once the monster appears, so you have to pick it up fast. Especially if you take damage. Fuck. Uh, you shouldn't look directly at it. Try I'm not looking directly at it. <laughs> what should I do? That's your new friend. That's your new friend, Mr. Pillar. Do I have that? Is that a closet? Uh, you can do absolutely nothing about it. And then if you open that door, he's gonna see you. Just don't pay any mind to it. It's not there. It's, it's out of my mind. It's not there. It's not there. It's not there. It's not that. It's not that. It's not how's your, there. how's your friend Mr. Pillar doing? <sighs> Daniel is doing the panting for you. How's your friend Mr. Pillar doing? <laughs> I have no idea. Ask him. <laughs> it's good for your soul. Is he turning away? Or? Yeah, yeah, he's got. He is uh, leaving. Avoid looking at enemies for too long. It will drain your sanity, and you will eventually be seen. Your sanity is now dangerously low, which basically means that if you see a monster again, you're probably like, you're most likely going to faint. So you should probably restore it in some way, and that is light source and make progress, as it says. It's quite simple, really. So find a candle and stare at it for an extended period of time. Why would you open the door again? You huh? didn't pick up the fourth item. I did. I picked up the witch call, didn't I? Lord of them. That's something that heals you if you take damage. Oh, fuck! I thought that was the thing. You should probably read the tool tips when they give them to you. <laughs> I thought that was just stating it outright. Can I turn my lantern on? Yeah. Okay. As soon as you hear a um, an angry monster, you should probably turn it off again now. Yes, Captain. Oh god, I am so fucking insane right now. How much sand do I have? Okay, it's just three okay, dots. You are, it, it can't get lower than that. Oh, fucked. So do I am. Oh, by the way, once your sanity has reached its lowest point, uh, the um, the paintings around the castle will look a lot more interesting. There it is. After I grab that, do I run? 
Oh, well, the door, both doors in here are currently open, so you are in a no escape scenario. Just not trying to scare you, but I'm doing it. <laughs> Why would you tell me that? Well, I'm just saying you're in the wine cellar and the only way out is up, and there's a monster in here somewhere. Fucking hell. It's <laughs> just a pin the box. <laughs> Uh, try taking a look at the door that was locked before. I this, think it's open this now. One? This is the door that was locked. Ah, okay. Fair enough. Well, where do I go? Wait, you, you don't have all items, do you? Unless it, the thing uses loading them. Try taking a look at the notes for uh, the um, the chem chemistry notes he has. Uh, Chemical relocation? Early, early alchemy experiment, I think. Entirely. Uh, Calamine, Orpiment, and uh, Cupride, and Aqua Regia. So you need one more, I think. You have um, you have Calamine and Orpiment, I think. So you need Cupride, right? Aqua oh, you have Regia. Cupamine and Calamine. So you, <clears throat> so you need Orpiment. Is the fourth thing there? Or Orpiment? If you go to the bar right. Huh? Oh. Um, no, no. The, the things that heals you is probably called Lordaman or something, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you need to find Orpiment. It's in here somewhere. It must be in here, I'm assuming. That would make sense, wouldn't it? <laughs> What's that? The best thing the best thing about this game is that you have no way to fight, so you have to hide. What sounds the monsters make? Uh garden noises. I think that's the only way to explain it really. You can also hear them walking, I think. Yeah. And if you look directly at them, you will hear a uh, very, very weird... Uh, I, I don't even want to call it a song, but a uh, a tune will start playing that really... It's meant to make the player go, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> so... I'm hearing whisper. There it is. Uh, Daniel has whispered. <laughs> so, uh, look around. Do we have any way to escape? Uh, the door right b over there. Yeah. But uh, that's from whence you came. If you look at where the item is located, it's in a blind alley. No way out. Just to give you a sense of comfort. Fucking hell. <laughs> Your sanity has been restored, if only a little bit. As soon as you have gotten up, you're good. Now you just went out. By the way. Uh, I think you, if you uh, hold down shift. And I think you're crouching right now, so you're moving slower. I'm out. <laughs> now you have to go to the chemistry room. I'm assuming there are mo no monsters right now in the main area. Well... <laughs> Don't take that toe with me. <laughs> the ghetto is getting Ouch. closer, as you can see. That's right, right Isn't that That's just pretty bad? bad. Oh, wait, do no, I have to, to go? To find the chemistry room. You have to do chemistry now. Yeah. You have everything you need to make, uh, as the game calls it, acid. Don't I already have that? It's that one, right? Uh... You, you do already have acid, yes, but the game wants you to make acid with the items you have, even though three of them don't add anything to the potency. <laughs> it's this room over here, right? I don't remember. Uh, remember that I'm working on a five second delay, so... Laboratory. And that's the right way. Is it really full five seconds right now? 
Well, it was a moment ago. I don't know if it's um I had a jittery slideshow at some point, but you know. Ah. Yeah, that's um Remember, you have no reason to be scared. Why? Because you are Daniel. Okay, you have every reason to be scared. Never mind. Exactly. But at least there's a light source here. Okay. After I put these chemicals in, will something bad happen? I don't... Well, you're gonna get a vat of acid. Um, <laughs> I assume that's a bad thing to walk around with. And you're not working with a fume hood, and that can't be very bad. But in the game, not really. I don't think so. Doesn't have. Okay, I'm crystal clear sanity right now. Woo! Yeah, a few cuts and bruises there. Hmm, that's fine. Okay, so you're telling me that once I put that together, monsters aren't gonna show up and try to kill me? I don't think so, no. I don't remember monsters being in this in the laboratory, other than the water monster down there, but that thing is locked away. Okay, if you're sure, we'll do this. Uh, I'm never sure. In a certain order. Apparently it automatically does it. What's the sound? Uh, the shadow doesn't want you progressing. There's a reason it put out that flesh thing in front of you. What happened? Oh, is that... No? Did it just send monsters my way or something? Let's do this well, quickly. Well, the, sh the shadow is actively trying to kill you, and you are actively trying to kill Alexander, so this is just a murder house. Oh, there we are. I just need to turn the things. <laughs> You're scared. I am, actually. When you can't fight back, you get a lot more, I don't know, fearful. Now, I've never been good with horror games to begin with. That's the point. Oh, do I have to... okay. Please don't explode. I'm doing science. Look at me, still talking about the science, dude. dude. Now you have... Now you have a uh, green liquid that's called acid. It's color-coded for your convenience. Green means it dissolves things. Ah, I see. Yeah, and that's also totally how it works in real life. <laughs> oh. There's no such thing as a uh, odorless or colorless substance that is also acidic. Really? <laughs> no. I am being sarcastic. Okay. I'm ac I'm actually incredibly annoyed at the game, folk. <laughs> I mean, Aquaregia on its own would dissolve that fleshy thing you're gonna <laughs> pour this acid over. And so. Oh, fucking. Yep, that's what the sh that's what the uh, shadow does. It wants to kill you, so stay in here and starve to death. Oh, uh, so is that open now over there? No, okay. No, you have to get back up. You gotta make your um, staircase now. Oh, let's build a staircase, eh? I yep. did like building my own staircases. Sponsored by IKEA. <laughs> hey, 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 you can't say that. We don't have an IKEA sponsorship. Not yet, at least. IKEA, call me. <laughs> I'm serious. Uh, I'll do promotions IKEA here. 
I for one love building staircases here and you still need to build something. You can't make a jump just like that. Barrels. Or a chair, whatever works. Chair. Come back. <laughs> this is my chair, damn it. No, come back. What are you trying to do? I'm trying to get the chair upright. That way I can stand on uh. it. <sighs> Fucking wow. hell. This chair is just so uncooperative. Maybe if I drop it. Nope. Well, it worked. <laughs> you are a god amongst men. <laughs> Your intelligence is just so... It's a very special flavor of intelligence, let's just put it that way. You can say that again. I'm just so smart. Question, are there going to be monsters beyond this hole? Don't worry, stupid people can't get eaten. I... I just ran over oil, so I must be very stupid. It became impossible to avoid. The commotion industry inspect for his attention. As he opened the shutters, the French soldiers opened fire on the two young men fighting back. Their voices were silenced in the haze of gun smoke. Ouch. I think the amount of damage you've taken is a bit more than a few cuts and bruises now. Just staying. Nope. No. No. Fair enough. Okay. So, um, remember the giant fleshy thing? Now you can get through there. Okay. Well then, looking at the time here, let's do that. Let's save that for next time then. Okay. Well, so next time this has been me making fun of these Naki Raccoons uh, fears. And I'm out of oil. So, next time we are fucked. Until then, we have our humanity. We're never fucked if we have humanity. So until then, <clears throat> we will see you next time. Ta-ta.